subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! So guys, it's Monday and we're at the warehouse, which is an unusual place to be on a Monday. But anyway, we are here and we're waiting for a special delivery. It's not quite Christmas time, but it, it's Christmas time for the Stoltman brothers. You may have seen Brian Shaw training with some spicy things at, back at his house. So uh, we're waiting for a nice delivery. So yeah, stay tuned, boys. Right guys, so as a few of you guys have been commenting saying Brian Shaw's been training with his Fingles fingers, we decided to get one made. So this is our wonderful Fingles finger. We've got a, a weight loadable pin here so we can, if it's too light, we can put more weight on it. Um, so a company, a local company to us, Ceramax, they very kindly offered to fabricate a Fingles finger. That's um, the boys just away. So huge shout out to Ceramax for doing that. Dean Ross, it was kind of... His, his baby, his uh, little project to do, so we're very much appreciated. And what a job they did of it, eh? And also, Roski and Engineering, they kind of supplied the pipe and stuff, so um, it's a bit of weight in it, actually. It's quite heavy. Um, it'll be fun, i tell you that. So we'll probably get into this Friday, Friday for our events day. They're actually uh, making us a... Wait for height as well. Wait for height frame. frame yeah. So that's pretty awesome to have. But yeah, we're just buzzing. It's just that's one of the benefits of staying in the small community where we do is that people are very willing to help, um, which is which is amazing. So thank you very much, Sarah Max, yeah. and all the guys. We've got deadlifts now, so let's go and deadlift, baby. Right, guys, that's us back in the Stoneman Strength Centre. We are officially open. Gyms in Scotland are open. We're going to go train deadlifts. We're gonna get it! Where'd you get your shorts from? Hook Stoltman. As you all are aware, my last pair of rebound shorts were ripped. I got a nice new shiny pair. And also, I got a nice pair for Tom as well. You're welcome, Tommy. Thank you. I wonder where we got them from. <laughs> How's your warm-ups going, Tom? Good, man, good. Um, feeling good. Maybe it's the boys' shorts, you never know, say, si, boy, but... Yeah, they're feeling good. Feeling good. Feeling good. The suit just gives you a bit more tension off the ground so it acts like a, an elastic band when you're since your body you're coming down it acts more like a spring so the thing behind wearing the suit is it gives you a lot more momentum a lot more pop off the ground um, if you can use it properly uh, this is the first time back in my suit for a few months now it's not very nice it's just everything's just restricted everything's very tight I've just got it on quite loose just now. The more sessions that we go on, I'll increase the tightness every time and hopefully that'll help with a, a little bit of momentum off the, off the floor and help with the lockout. So just so that set my figure of eight um, just slipped off my hand so I'm just going to switch to conventional see how that goes, hopefully that will make a wee difference. Because this is the 
first time kind of up in the weight with a new stance, so just have to fucking just have to get used to that. It's um, just trying to feet position, so I'll just have to try and suck it up and get on with it, but we'll get there. Right guys, normal deadlifts done, 320 for 5 for me, Looked at a couple of sets 320 as well, um, how did it feel for you Lucas? So the last set was okay, uh, I think Tom made a good point, I think I was just overthinking things a little bit, had my suit on it just didn't feel right so I took it off and felt a lot better there that last set of 3 so that was good. Um, it's better to do things like that in training than it is on the day so. What about you, easy enough? Yeah it was easy enough, like again last week and that I overthinking things so it's more just like what we always do, strap in, pull, we know how to deadlift, we know how to do all these exercises but once you start overthinking things then it starts to become like a 700k deadlift but yeah, it felt decent enough for me so And now we go on to the Killer. axle, the Mirafit axle bar 20 inch Jeez. or deadlift so we're going heavy in this one so stay tuned for some nosebleeds I need your help, Simon, please. He's struggling. Simon, are you enjoying this, Simon? <laughs> I was wondering where that bit was. Right guys, that was our axle deadlifts done. So, big Tommy smashed out what you're doing. Four, four ten for three sets of two. Easy man. Nearly brought my foot in there, taking off the weights, but it is what it is. Yeah, it felt alright. Um, just trying to keep them going heavy, heavy. So, yourself, how do you just. Not so good. Everyone has their bad days, don't they? So. It's just one of those. Uh, I think I'm overthinking things today, uh, which is a pain. Um, but it is what it is. Didn't really go to plan at all, so might have to rework or have a look, re look at the programming. Um, going heavy, 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 heavy might not be a. It might fluctuate, change, change that. I'll see see what Dan says. I'll chat with him tonight. You're quite good at going lighter speed stuff as well and technique work. And yeah, stuff. I think maybe it might be an option to do that because I I don't my body doesn't really work. If so last week did 380. Um, for three sets of three, which was our PB, and then this week, 400 for sets of two. Three sets of two have been our PB. So obviously we can't do PBs every week, but um, there's always next week. Always next week. Makes a change that he's having a bad session. Okay, so. so that's deadlifts done anyway. So we're going on to our accessories. So stay tuned for some pump work. So it's a bit wet outside, so rather than set up the Hercules hold, we're going to do some dead hands off the bar or off the rig. Um, are we going to go together? Yeah. Go together and see 
hung tough. Gladiator style. Stay tuned. So you get the stopwatch, please. Tom's cheating, he's got some blue fancy bands in the bar. Some yeah. cheaters on the bar, mate. That's not sticky. Feel it. Jeez, oh, I couldn't take my hand away from it. Cheating. I was going, but I seen him go down and I was like, you know, it's all about the mind. Like We're going to swap because uh, Luke started crying, so I better get the slippiness in. Time's it, Snape? Almost a minute. Minute. Oh. oh, it looks like somebody was cheating. Hmm. That's the session done. How's it for you? Good. 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 Yeah, good, yeah. Good, a good session. The gym was good. Good. Yeah. yeah, it was good. The line wasn't so good, so that's basically how you don't deadlift watching that video. But we've always got next week, so. Get back to the drawing board. Still hit 320 for three. Okay, so that's not bad. But I just need to be improving a little bit more with the deadlifts. But that's all on me. Take accountability. Don't blame anyone. It's only you, him, or you that you can blame. Isn't that right? <laughs> exactly. So take accountability. That's what I've got to do. I didn't prepare enough for today. That's on me. So I've got to go back. What did I do over the weekend? Maybe didn't eat enough food, didn't get enough sleep. There's all those factors that can come into your training. So next week, I'll be a better deadlift session. Mark my words. What's that? Marking your words. All right, it's Mark my words. Stay safe, smell, and stay spicy. Thanks for watching, guys. Ring that little bell. Ding, 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 ding.